Hey guys, FIFA Vic here with a FIFA 13 player review. Today we are reviewing Lamella, Eric Lamella. He is a Roma Argentinian. And uh, yeah, here are his stats in game. As you can see, we've got the border, but we'll go through that in a second. Um, the stats, as you can see, is five star skills. That's going to be the main talking point of this fella. Very, very skillful, all the tricks from this guy. Um, they have upped his pace and his agility and his touch and all that sort of thing, and his shooting a little bit as well. And uh, we'll get into the clips here now. Um, as you can see, he's got he's got the tricks, and uh, tricks are huge. If you can take the time to learn them this year, they are absolutely massive. They can you know, make a huge difference. You know, people are so not used to facing tricks that you can you can get past players so easy when you use them this time. Um, Lamella is um, he's really good. His normal card's really good, and it's only one k. So I do definitely recommend his normal card. Um, I think he's a great choice in that position. Um, with all the skills and not just his skills all his other stats as well so um, But so he's in form. I think it's it's a good in form and it's not going to be too expensive I picked mine up for 45k and um, So I don't think it's going to be too expensive So I do recommend it because they have just upped all his stats just a little bit in nice areas And I think that is perfect for him really um, As you can see he's scoring goals for me. I've got him at uh, right wing but you could convert him to right forward um, or right mid. The problem if you put him at right mid is that he has low defensive work rate and medium attacking work rate. And so what will happen there is he might not get in attacks enough and he won't do any defending for you at all. So you can see his free kick stats on the screen now. Um, he's got a good free kick. I like the guys that have um, mid 80s stats. Um, they don't curve it too much. It's easier to, to predict where it's going to finish in the top corner. And uh, not too much power. It's not going to go blazing over the bar. I do like it when the guys people have that sort of stat. He's left footed on the right hand side as well. So when he cuts in, he's a threat. And um, and so that is a good option as a second option in free kicks. If you've got a right footed free kick taker, he's a good left footed free kick taker. You can see his penalties here. Um, he has about 80 penalty and um, yeah, it does the business on this occasion for me with that penalty. Um, yeah, so in the border guys, as you can see, we've got his hot stats, his dribbling, his ball control. 99 stamina is good as well for a winger. Um, his shooting is good, don't forget he's left footed as well, so he's going to cut in on that side. Um, his agility, his touch, ball control, all that sort of stuff is the good stuff. Um, the weaknesses, guys, he's only got three-star weak foot, and playing on the right-hand side when he's a, when he's a left-footed player, that can be awkward. Some of his crosses are a bit weak, or if you have to take a right-foot shot, sometimes it can be a bit weak. But um, So that's a weakness. His work rate, as we've said, he's only got low defensive and medium attacking, which as, at right wing, I don't think is a problem, but at right mid, I think that would cause you a lot of trouble. I think you'd lose a lot of shape if you, did, if you uh, had that like that. Um, so that is that guys um, as you can see scored quite a few goals with him um, his skills are just so much fun to use I definitely recommend buying him cheers guys